that flash of panic when your GPS dies. Now imagine that feeling for months on a lightless ocean. This wasn't a hypothetical. In 1707, a British fleet, just miles from home, crashed onto the rocks. 2,000 men died because they were lost. In desperation, the British government offered a prize, a chest of gold worth millions. But the wealthy academics on the board believed it was impossible. Their official solution was purely academic, a lunar distance method requiring complex equations and a perfectly clear view of the stars. But the solution wouldn't come from an astronomer. It came from a humble carpenter, John Harrison, who had a simple radical idea. But that idea was considered impossible. At sea, a pendulum clock stops working. The humidity swells the wood and the salt spray rusts the gears. He spent decades solving the impossible. He replaced the pendulum with new grasshopper springs and used materials that wouldn't rust or warp. His final creation, H4, was tested on a brutal voyage to Jamaica. When the ship arrived, Harrison's clock was seconds off, while the ship's official log was miles off. John Harrison, the clockmaker who solved longitude,